Titans, welcome to another video. In this video, we'll show you how to change text dynamically for radio, checkbox, button, or button list. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to get over here, and first we're going to get a drop down. This is what's going to trigger the set value, and I'm just going to keep it very simple. I'm going to say choose topic, and the two topics that are available are fruits and colors and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to get some checkboxes I'm going to get some radio buttons and I'm going to get some list buttons okay so here's what we're going to do I'm just going to get rid of uh, the default value there uncheck add other uncheck add other and uncheck add other so if I select fruit I want these three values for every single one of them to change into fruits if I choose colors I want three values in each of these to change into colors sounds simple right let's let's show you so go to conditioning set conditions I'll say if current field equals fruits then go ahead and these this is my um, my checkbox here and what I'm going to do next to first choice, I'm going to set text. And that text is going to be, let's say, apple. And then I'll set text to the second one to be mango. And third one can be banana. Like that. And then for my radio button, I'll do the same. We'll set text like this. set text and then set text and just like that paste it in there paste it in there paste it in there you can see it, the premise is the same really for every um, single type here so copy copy that copy that copy that and like that all right that's for fruits if it equals colors I want to change this to red, this to blue, and this to yellow. Just like that, I will change it for every single one of them. And just like that, we've done it. Okay, so that's what we're doing. So this is my radio button, and the first choice, I'm setting the text to be red, blue, or yellow, if it equals colors. Now look what happens. If I click Save, and I preview, if I choose Fruits, you can see they've now changed into Fruits. If I do Colors, they've changed into Colors. All right? This is how you set it dynamically, the text on each of these um, field types so if you want to do it like this you can do it like this just like that but you need to understand where to do it so once you've got it enabled go to your con conditions however you want to set your conditions it's really up to you at the end of the day but focus on um, the the choices that you have and then setting the text for those choices like this and uh, that's how you do it 